Stacking is Double Fine's second downloadable title following the excellent Costume Quest from last October, and just like Costume Quest, Stacking is something very special. In Stacking you play as Charlie, the youngest child of a family that's torn apart by their child labor-driven industrial society. When all of his siblings are taken to work off the family debt, it's up to Charlie to set out into the world and reunite his broken family. Along the way, Charlie is going to encounter a number of challenges which he couldn't possibly manage on his own. But thankfully, he lives in a world populated by nesting dolls. Charlie is able to take advantage of being the smallest nesting doll around to stack himself inside of the other dolls, hopping inside of them like some sort of reverse chest burster. Once inside, Charlie is able to take complete control of the other dolls, using their abilities as he sees fit to accomplish what he otherwise wouldn't be able to on his own. Each type of doll that you encounter has their own unique ability. Some of them might seem rather pointless or mundane at first, but just about all of them serve a purpose. Here's an example of how this works with the first challenge of the game, getting inside of the club. The guard won't budge for you, but if you talk to him for a bit, you'll find out that he has a weakness for women. You look around for a bit, and then you notice that one of the dolls kind of stands out. One body invasion later, and you are successfully seducing the guard away from the door, distracting him long enough so that you can sneak around and hop inside of him and force him to open the door for you. Challenge complete. Well, sort of. The puzzles in stacking have multiple solutions. Some of them are very obvious, others are a bit more abstract. The game really wants you to take your time with things. Thoroughly explore your options and think before you act. If you aren't going to do these things, then you may as well not play this game at all. You would simply miss out on too many of the things that make this game great. I found myself spending a lot more time than I'd expected simply appreciating the details in stacking. I love how the cutscenes are styled after silent movies. I love how the dolls react to things. Either other dolls that are passing by them, or things that you're doing around them, but not necessarily to them. I love how this hand cart is made of popsicle sticks and plastic spoons, like it's something that some kid made for a school project. I really love how well done the sound is. If I were to continue and show you more of the things that really impressed me with stacking, I would be robbing you of the surprise that made those things stand out to me so much to begin with. It wouldn't be fair. Stacking is the sort of game that you want to go into with as little information as possible, which is why everything that I've shown you comes from the first 30 minutes of play, which is practically the tutorial. I don't rate games on a scale. I won't rate this game on a scale but I will tell you that I think this might be one of the best downloadable titles currently available on consoles. It's an excellent game, one of Double Fine's best, and definitely worth more than the $15 that you'll pay for it.